Welcome back to Better Living on this Monday. I'm Stephanie Martinez in for Charity Freeman today. Well, we do have a very nice guest with us this morning. We have Jeremy Baumhauer from iHeartGlassCity.com. Again, thanks for coming in. I'm very nice. Thank you. You are very nice. That's You're lovely. That's why we love having you on. I'm, yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm lovely. That might be the first time I've been described as lovely in my life. So Possibly thank you. first and last. No, I'm just no. kidding. But you have, you have done one of the nicest things, and you were able to partner with um, another group to do this, to make a couple of mothers kind of a dream for them come true. Yeah, Cozy Dental, um, like I, I had I, um, maintained earlier, were helping me. Mm -hmm. um, so they were able to do, um, they, they really wanted to step forward and really help. I thought was just one mom, which is now two moms. Um, I mean, this is tens of thousands of dollars worth of work. It, it, and it is, but for people just joining us, what campaign were you doing that um, led to them helping you out? It was, uh, we, we wanted to do something really nice for Mother's Day. So this was a Mother's Day mom's mouth makeover, which is a mouthful. Um, <laughs> but yeah, we, we took submissions and it, it, you know, the interviewing process, the screening process, because um, you don't know what you have coming in, you know, you don't know what people are dealing with. And you want to make sure that it's the right candidate of a person. It's one thing to see it in a letter nominated. It's another to get the story. So uh, Cozy was very comfortable um, with one winner. And then it evolved into two winners because of the personal connections. Um, so their process starts now. Um, we videoed the whole um, the reveal last week mm -hmm. where we get to tell them. So we'll have that. And next time I'm on, I'll bring that, which will be a five or six minute video. But it's probably one of my most favorite moments that I've experienced as a writer. Because when you get to tell someone that their life's going to change and having that I've dealt with it myself, that stress, mm -hmm. oh, it's such a good moment. And it's, it, it's such a lovely thing because the doctors are, uh, are, are teary eyed and uh, th these women are just elated. It's such, I, I, and I met the second one. I had to kind of like I had a like I was almost mean for him and I'm like you know they already had a winner and she and it was Lori was the one I got to tell second Lori was like that's fine she was probably very deserving even in that moment she was like that's okay and I was like oh no but and then they like jumped forward and were like no 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 you win you win too everyone wins you two win right and well that's very nice of them to give of course uh, two very w deserving ladies uh, this gift of a brand new smile that being one of them there on the that's screen. Lori and her daughter Bree and um, just that great energy that Toledo she's she's like my mom I mean my, <laughs> the mom that whatever you need like right now as I'm helping you here my kids are in religion all week mm -hmm. so she's going to pick up my kids at religion to have camp Sue time so they can swim and that was you know on my ADD notice of hey mom will you go pick up the kids so I can relate with these women because I know what it's like to have a strong mom who would drop anything and do whatever, you know, to help you. So, you know, and this is Dodie, and Dodie um, has been dealing with personal tragedy and can't seem to get in front of it. But um, as she's dealing with it, she's putting her family first. So these were uh, two excellent winners, two mm -hmm. great examples of women that we have, the caliber of strength, which I believe makes us different as a community um, because they're so selfless. I mean, they just... They just do first and ask second later, like, what do you need? Okay, you need a new, you know, like Lori bought cars and she's helping pay for her son's wedding. So again, a great, a great thing for these women to want all that they have done for their families. Again, now giving them the chance to get something that they are very deserving of. Yeah, and you can, if you go to my website, which is iHeartGlassCity, you'll have more information. You can read up about it. We'll have the videos and for the updates. And I'm looking forward for, to that. For future contests like mm -hmm. this, because it won't necessarily be a mouth, but... Um, something like what we're doing for the summer, which is right now, um, as, if you're a parent like me and you have your kids home, which is so much fun. Um, it, could, it can be. It can also be. Also a bit trying, I'm sure. And I, and I, yes, because <laughs> your life's different, especially if you're a stay at home or you work out of the house. Uh -huh. um, I Heart Glass City, we have partnered up with some great businesses like uh, Little Caesars, Jacob's Pizza, Berry Bagels, um, Jan's fam Famous Chili Dogs, um, to get a prize pack. Um, for kids to give us content. Mm -hmm. And I think content's a weird word for mom and dad, but what we want to do is we're looking for submissions from kids of book reports, but in a, in a book they want to write, or maybe they want to write a review about um, the, the movie this weekend of Jurassic it's World, right. or a short story, or if they want to take their camera out and take a beautiful picture of some type of art, or um, if they want to shoot a little movie and put a w movie together. If they want to do a dub smash, I'm willing for dub smash entries. Have you dealt with dub smash? I have not, but uh, all of this is welcome there on a on your phone. I, I want and here's the challenge for Stephanie. You're gonna sign up for dub smash, which is anything. Mm -hmm. 
and it is literally you um it records your face and then it gives you sound from like something famous mm -hmm. and it automatically edit and it's perfect for social media it's perfect for your facebook and it's a lot of fun okay and that's I'll what the kids are doing dub smash i promise you it's fun <laughs> there's a lot of like uh, little minions like stuff like that the kids love it um i sit there and it's and if you're looking for something fun parents to do with your kids and you're not afraid to um speak into your phone um you know like take a little selfie video which we do often you do especially like i, I mean I know for the older generation, I mean, you guys aren't texting yet. You're still on the phone calls, and I like to do that. And I like that um, texting is kind of like the younger generation. Our kids, this, my kids' generation, will be the FaceTime generation. That is they true. literally FaceTime. They FaceTime me all the time, and it's. I feel bad when you have to hit ignore. I have to feel like, no, Dad's working. <laughs> Can't you know, do it because right now. it's never anything important. I mean, it is, right? I love you both, but you know, it's not important. <laughs> Um, if you're watching right now and you catch this. But, you know, parents, this is important maybe to get your kids to do a little book report um, throughout the summer. A little daily thing, a little thin book. Yeah. And then to send that report in because, again, you could win some ice cream or pizza. Yeah, and we'll send you, uh, there's a prize pack and it's something, and on top of it, we'll publish it on the website. Um, and if your kid can sing or they, they're looking for a break and for some exposure, we have on average about 20, 25,000 people that visit the website every day. So that in itself will give, you know, and I'm not... You know, I, I just want to give the kids a reason to write. And you know, that's a good reason that you are definitely giving their right uh, with what you're offering there on iHeartGlassCity.com. I'm going to say it again, iHeartGlassCity.com. Go there and make sure that your little one's submitting something. Why not? Uh, I, and did I hear something? Did you guys get Christy Lee? We did. She is, yes, she is here, and we love having her. Ken, I'll tell you, another wonderful, that. That, makes, that makes two of us, I have to admit, right there. Stay right here on NBC24, because on Better Living Up next, we're going to be hearing from Teresa Pollock. We'll hear the latest from the roads, all the information that you need to know. We'll be right back.